Hey girls, welcome to my makeup inspired by Melissa Gorga from the Real Housewives of New Jersey. Super fabulous lashes, a gray smoky eye. I take you step by step through the whole video on how to get this amazing look. I'll see you on my next video. So I'm going to start off with my Fresh Beauty Studio Eye and Lip Primer. This is going to create a wonderful base for your eyeshadow and your lipstick or gloss. It's going to take away any discoloration, redness. And I'm going to go in with my gray palette. It's called Gray Matters from Fresh Beauty Studio. I'm going to take the lightest color and do a brow highlight. And then I realized, oh, I got to do my brows. Totally forgot. So I'm going to brush them down and I want to make a little bit more of an arch so I can see exactly where it needs to be. And then I'm going to take that spoolie and just kind of blend it all in together so you can't see that I went a little bit higher. And now I'm going to take the really nice kind of gray, silvery color for my base. I'm gonna work it in across the whole lid. And then I'm gonna take a blending brush with this darker gray and I'm gonna swirl it onto my lid into my crease. And this is just about building coverage. I mean, if you really want it to be way over the top, you can just keep building and you'll see with the darker colors that you can keep going depending on really what kind of look you want. So I'm gonna go in with a deeper gray now and I'm gonna just go into my crease and really work it and blend it because you really want to blend all of these colors together. You don't wanna see any lines where one color starts and one color fades. So I'm going in with a little bit of a blending brush here and you'll see I stick it right into the eye socket and I really blend it out. I'm going in with a rich dark black color. Now these palettes are very highly pigmented so you've got to be careful when you're working with them that you don't over dispense the eyeshadow and then really have a lot to deal with and really can't blend it out. So that's just a little, little tip there. So I'm going to blend this again and you can see how nicely it does blend out. I'm going to go in with the L'Oreal Smolder Pencil. I'm going to go into my tight line underneath. This is really dramatic and it really makes a big difference. And then my waterline on the bottom and I'm going to line that so it really gives you that darkness around the eye. And now I'm going to clean up with my Almay pad. And I'm gonna just go in with a smudge brush with the black and just kind of work that into the eyeliner. And I have my L'Oreal, these are doll lashes mascara. I'm gonna just do a nice coat, not too much because I am gonna be putting on the false lashes, but I do wanna pile up a lot for my bottom lashes. These are mink lashes. They are amazing. They go on so easy with a super, super thin cotton band and you don't even know you're wearing them. So these are wonderful and you can see they just really kind of mold to your eyelashes. This is my RCMA palette. I'm just gonna go a little bit deeper because she has a beautiful tan and I don't, but when you do this, you wanna make sure you get your ears and go all the way down on your neck. So you want to color everything that is very fair, like myself, and give yourself a nice tan. I'm gonna go in with Invisible Powder from Fresh Beauty. I'm going to just set my foundation. And then this is Exotic Blend Bronzer from Fresh Beauty. I'm gonna just go into chiseling my cheeks and adding some more bronzy color. And I love this, this is a cheek highlight. It's called Breathe. It's just so pretty. This is a really, really pretty, pretty pink. It's like a peony pink. I use it a lot on my brides. And then this is a lipstick from Fresh Beauty called Whirly Girl. And it's a really nice nude. It just really goes on very nicely. And I'm gonna top it off with Girl Stuff, a long-lasting lip gloss infused with vitamin E and a hint of vanilla. So it's really fun to wear it. And there you got your fabulous look.